and we are off to catch the bus. found a bus stop, I think I'm picking the one that's in the right direction, just going to cross the road here carefully. There's people sitting at the bus stop so that's a good sign, it means there'll be a bus. So it's going in the right direction, I think it should be that way. Oh. Here's my bus stop. <laughs> Let's see which way it's going. I don't recognise any of the places. Oh, yes, here comes my bus. to Plaza de España. They're beautiful. There's a little uh, like a moat that goes around like a canal where you can take rowboats out. There's this beautiful fountain in the middle. Amazing historic buildings and there's some park that I'll show you there. You can take a horse ride around the area or around bed parts of the city in a horse and carriage. It's blazing hot. Nice cool breeze off a fountain. It's nice and cool over there in the shade. Let me show you around a little bit. So that's the Plaza de España in Sevilla. A very beautiful, that was oh, a fantastic morning we have had walking around there. Now wandering through the gardens behind 
into the city area to find something to eat. And rounding up the evening at the plaza outside the cathedral in Surveyor. It is beautiful. Let me show you, it's a very popular place. There's lots of restaurants, lots of tapas bars, lots of places to eat, lots of friendly people. The cathedral is lit up. Let me show you around. It's really beautiful. And then I've got to find my way home on a bus. I hope the bus is still running. Can you believe? Have a look around first. I'll get back to you. Surprise! I'm lost in Sevilla. It's a nice lost. I'm just sort of wandering down this little hotel. So I've wandered off the main street, taking a shortcut <laughs> through the little alleys and streets to find my way to either I'm either in a flamenco bar or a my bus stop. <laughs> Moment, it's looking like neither. The trouble is, I look down the street, like down there, and like, oh, pretty lights, things going on, things to see, so much to show you. Okay, let me check the map again and see if I'm going vaguely the right direction.
Okay, first place we found it was Cabanaria, which is the flamenco dancing bar. I hope. So let's go down this Darkadeli, the handwritten sign, and see what I find. Hmm. <laughs> Indeed, possibly, possibly. Can hear sounds, singing and dancing. Oh, and it looks busy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> It's busy, busy, busy. We're going to be lucky to get a good seat here. <laughs> well, the cantina, the cantina, cantina near, was great fun, packed. But, can't show any footage because we were not allowed to film in there. So I did record some of the sounds, so I can play those to you. Hopefully somewhere else I'll find some flamenco dancers and uh, to show you. So it's now midnight. I'm now wandering around random alleys, only vaguely lost, hoping the buses are still running, heading to the road to the bus stop. Down the strange little road. Right, let's see. Um, I think we still need to go this way. Every now and again you come out on a bigger road and then you think you know where you are and then you go down side alley and then you're lost again. And last like this one. So left or right. Oh boy. So right. Or left. Who knows? Not me. Good news, no longer completely lost, and I found a bus stop. And it says the 21, which is the bus I took here, hopefully I'm not going in the other direction, is due in six minutes. All the information is up in the bus. Bus number, where it's going, and how many minutes before arrival. Now five minutes. Now I have to remember where to get off. Huh. Should have paid more notice. Plus it was light when I left, and it's dark now, and things look so different. So. I'm going to guess the approximate distance by time and hope I hop off fairly near my accommodation and then could find my way there. This night may not be over yet, but so far I'm currently unlost and waiting for a bus. I think I've made it. Looks familiar. I think I go down here, turn right, turn left. Yep. Hey! Even got off at the right stop. Didn't quite fall asleep. So, it's down here. It's quiet. Not awake in a bit. Pardon me. Goodness knows what time it is. But yeah, that was actually quite easy. I don't know what time the bus has stopped running, but uh, I was quite grateful there was one. One euro twenty for a fifteen minute ride, as opposed to an eight or nine euro taxi plus any late fees. Just gotta walk this last little bit home then. And uh, yeah, I'm sure I'm in the right place. It's just down here. I'll be home before we know it. <laughs>